Local 10 News starts right now. Good morning, South Florida. I'm Eric Yutze. Here's a look at your top stories on this Monday morning. Two men are dead after shots were fired in Southwest Miami-Dade. Detectives say the shooting stemmed from an altercation between four people on Southwest 240th Street on Sunday evening. Two men found dead there. Officers, they've taken one person into custody. They are investigating that person's involvement. They say other, another man took off before they arrived. And police responding to a hit and run crash involving a pedestrian in Northwest Miami-Dade. This happened just after five o'clock on Sunday afternoon along Northwest 7th Avenue and 111th Street. A man was rushed to Jackson Memorial Hospital. An investigation is ongoing. It is unclear if any arrests have been made. We'll bring you more details as they come into the newsroom. Three nights of Taylor ending with a bang in South Florida. She performs the last leg of her Eras World Tour for three nights. Swifties flock to Hard Rock Stadium to see the pop star stake take the stage. Our cameras there through it all as Swifties dressed in Taylor's signature outfits. Some fans battled it out trying to score last minute tickets. She opened on Friday, performed to more than 60,000 fans every night. In-person early voting begins today in Miami-Dade and Broward counties and in the Florida Keys for the upcoming presidential election and other key races. All locations open at 7 a.m. People have started to send in their ballots by mail as well. There's a secure box at every early voting site in all three counties for drop-off. As breaking news happens, we will keep you covered on air and online. Head to local10.com for more local news coverage and updates.